Hello and welcome to FNS Bushcraft. I'm Matt and today we've come to finish the uh, debris shelter and uh, as you can see somebody's dropped it. Uh, we did come up here last week and uh, before we did all the moss and the branches it had we thought it had fallen over, but we didn't put that in the video. We just cracked on and rebuilt it. Um, we thought it was the wind, maybe it fell over or something, but this week we've come back and it's completely flat. So we're gonna have to move location again. Um, we do have plans for a new shelter, so stay tuned for the video and uh, crack on as always. And sorry I've not said much, as you can imagine. My piss is boiling. <laughs> No secret, just remember how to construct the lash in the first initial knot and just try and keep the tension on. That's dead simple. Just keep keep things tight. Yeah, and all we're using there is some kind of cheap tow rope. <laughs> tow rope. <laughs> that you could probably pick up at any any kind of outdoorsy type shop, you know, like go outdoors or a mountain warehouse or something. Even B and Q maybe. But an alternative to doing it the way we're doing it is you could find specific poles that have Y branches at the top. Yeah. Slow uh, and then just interlock it all together so you don't have to use any cordage. But in the prospect of saving time we've just used lashing because we obviously we'd be searching for hours to try and find you know, six or seven poles of Y branches at one end, so.
Treasure chest. Yeah, so all we're trying to do, guys, is just dig a pit, basically, on the inside of the teepee. Well, we wanted to dig out the duff, but then hit loads of roots. Yeah, we just wanted a little hollow in the middle, and then have a, have a fire pit in the middle. Um, can't have a fire pit if there's roots. But, yeah, if there's loads of roots, then we can't. We are in a dying forest, so don't all the, you know, eco-warriors panic. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, so hope you've enjoyed this video. Thank you very much for tuning in and watching. This has been FNS Bushcraft. If you'd like to see more of our content, please like, comment, subscribe. Um, please comment, we love interacting with you guys and answering any questions that you have. Um, this has been the start of our wiki up slash TP style shelter. Um, and just to revise what we've done today, we've got the initial frame up, uh, we've done all the lashings around the top. And this ring that you see here above my finger, uh, this is where an air gap is going to be at the top so we can have a fire in the middle. Um, and what we've been doing for a while now is digging out the inside into a little pit um, so it's hollow. And in the centre is going to be another small pit and then we're going to hopefully line that with sand and stones um, and, and have a little fire in the middle which will be awesome. Um, Task for next episode is to get that finished off because we're not completely finished today. We never are. <laughs> never enough time in the day for these things. Um, but yeah, get this finished off and then on to finishing the framing, getting more logs on. <coughs> I'll come bring you around the other side. <coughs> Branch there. Oh, so, we've got more logs on this side so it becomes more of a cone shape. Uh, it's, we started off with three poles and we lashed them at the top and it, it was just kind of a, a flat triangle and then as you add more on it, it becomes more of a cylindrical shape and which gives you more room on the inside. Um, but yeah, I'm waffling again. So thank you very much for watching. Uh, shut up and, sign off, and we'll see you next time. <laughs> Bye for now.